What's up, art aficionados? Ready for some serious eye candy? Steve here again from NVIDIA. Okay, everyone loves mech creations, right? Well, today we're going to take a closer look at some really stunning examples and the amazing artists who make it happen. If you had to go to battle with one badass mech beast, I think a gorilla might be a pretty good choice. Ben Morrow obviously thinks so too, and his artwork shows it. He was originally inspired by photos of the gorilla's incredible power and striking silhouette, which gave him the visual ammo to build this quadruped warrior. A mounted machine gun, a munitions drum in the belly, smoke grenades that can be launched from the back of its head, this is one beast on the battlefield. And what impressive creative exploration. For Ben, it all started with sculpture explorations in ZBrush, which evolved into the B-28 Gorilla. He uses extreme contrast and a strong silhouette to not only bring this creature to the forefront, but also to create a smoky, dreamlike battlefield environment. This is highlighted even more by his muted color palette and amazing attention to detail in every mech muscle and feature of B-28, poised and ready to take on anything he faces on the battlefield. Next up, we have Furio Tedeschi, who created hyper-realistic mech ant soldiers based on, of all things, soldier ants. It's a cool mix of military and organic bug features that combine to make really interesting material structures that look strong enough to be actually used on the battlefield. We can also see Furio's decades-long experience in movies and video games in his work. Using real-time GPU rendering in his 3D applications lets him quickly experiment and refine his mech character until it's ready for battle. I mean, these look like completely plausible tech. Furio's details and use of lighting are rooted and grounded in a gritty reality that really draws you in to each piece. Need to protect the colony? No worries. Send in these army ants and you're guaranteed victory. All right, can you imagine taking your daily walk to the coffee shop and seeing this beast out on the street? Vitaly Bulgarov can and has created a series of pieces that show how awesome his mech anteater would look. For Vitaly, inspiration starts with the right music, what he calls a soundtrack to creative thinking. He hears the right song and he's off to the races. With this mech, he wanted to move beyond traditional sci-fi or military designs and make his work a celebration of forms and flow. Then, he thought, what if this creature could actually do good by consuming radioactive waste? And thus, the Atom Eater was born. Vitaly's experience working with real robotics makes every detail feel hyper-realistic, from the exposed cybernetic muscles to the robotic joints. The textures are striking, varied, and above all, uber-realistic. So much so that it feels like you could reach out and touch them. It's all part of his commitment to chase the, quote, impossible design, unquote, as he calls it. Something that's crazy looking, yet symmetrically perfect. Well, I think Vitaly has not only chased it, but he has captured it as well. Our final mech exploration is with visual effects guru, Alex Yeager. Alex is a 20-year industrial light and magic veteran who has instrumentally created some of the most recognizable icons in our pop culture lexicon. So with his cred, you can imagine my excitement and first reaction after seeing this mechanical creation. My first thought was, wow, these are beautiful. My second thought was, why spiders? Alex explains that it's all about functionality, that more legs means more fluid motion. This functionality drives a lot of what Jaeger creates, from the shock-reducing harnesses needed for human-piloted use to the protective plating needed for rough terrain search and rescue missions. Then, his creative vision takes over with brilliant colors, reflections, and a variety of materials that bring every piece to life. 
You scare spiders? Well, look, there's no need for arachnophobia here because these are benevolent mech. These creations not only do good, they look good, really good. Speaking of spiders, did you hear about the spider love triangle? It was a tangled web. <laughs>Wow, that was some really exciting work. Okay, I'll stop. Follow us on social at NVIDIA Creators for the latest and greatest and share your creations with hashtag StudioShare for a chance to be featured.